everybody. Glad you've made the decision to be with us. Alongside Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. We're glad to be bringing you action and welcoming you to the MGM Grand here on the Vegas Strip in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. Our main event should be a good one tonight. 15 rounds of heavyweight action. A lot of talk heading into tonight's matchup. Everybody expecting this to be a great night of action. Lewis is making his way to the ring now, and he looks very focused for this fight. Vitaly Klitschko's ring walks have been known as circus spectaculars, but yet, with all that, to him, it's a moment of extreme attention. dressing room. Let's have a good clean fight. Touch them up. All right, let's go. Round number one is now underway. All the talk is done. It is simply time to fight. Tall guy versus short guy here tonight in front of us. Teddy, why does it seem so hard sometimes that some tall fighters don't necessarily fight tall? Because, Joe, it takes great discipline to stay on the outside. You look at him, you say, hey, you're tall. I wish I was tall like that. But now it takes restraint, control to stay in those quarters and make sure you don't give in and allow... Fiddly Klitschko stunned and he is hurt. He goes from damaged goods to defensive goods. Yeah, because right now he's fighting on instincts. He's doing things without even thinking. Just automatic things. Things that he was taught five years ago, three years ago, that maybe he thought about, but he didn't do. Now they're just coming out. He's just naturally surviving. Vitaly Klitschko's putting a smile on his corner man's face right there and frustrating his opponent with that jab. Do that again! His opponent wanted the body. He wouldn't give it to him. At six foot seven and a half, when Vitaly Klitschko gets his full leverage, these headshots can be so damaging. Yeah, they can because he's shifting that whole six foot seven inches into the punch. Puts forth the hook, scores with it. So he decides to go downstairs early on, and I think he'll be happy with that decision later on. Well, it tells you that he's a well prepared fighter. He's going to, with a good game plan. They understood what they had in front of them. A guy that's going to move a little bit. Start going downstairs, taking the air out of the tires, and later on, he'll be in front of you. is able to land a nice clean left hand and he ties up on the inside just like that just a well like that. targeted jab that time and that's exactly what you need when you want to stay on the outside something to keep you away from your opponent
It's almost as if he's jousting with that left hand. Vitaly Klitschko brings so much behind it. Vitaly Klitschko's good, clean, and effective punching damaged his opponent in that last round. Okay, keep boxing. You're doing great. You're making it hard for him to hit you. He seems fully recovered to me. Here we are, the start of a new round, and a fighter that got tagged hard in the last round seems as fresh as could be. Well, when you push a fighter, when you push a human being to a dark place, that's when you're gonna find out what's bright inside of them, what's great inside of them. And he's responding just that way. Really on the mark with that over-the-top shot with the right hand. is now feeling the after effects of being rocked by a huge hook to the head. Solid left hand to the head. Turns over that hook upstairs. And right from the start, he's throwing the power punches and landing. Vitaly Klitschko's in a bad place right now. He was tagged. Oh, that was a smart move right there. He was hurt, but then he held on. That's a huge left he just scored. Oh, that's got to hurt. Boy, it is rare to say this, but Vitaly Klitschko is being outworked, outmanned, outboxed, and now he's down. One, two, three, four, five. Vitaly Klitschko's back up on his feet. What will he look like in the next few moments of this fight? That's the big question. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. Halfway through this round. With that frame, that size, and all that girth to his upper body, when Vitaly Klitschko lands that left hand, boy, it has quite an impact. Just a thudding shot there that he landed. Good looking uppercut that time. He clinches when he gets to the inside. Vitaly Klitschko's giving his opponent headaches here now. He's throwing punches, but he's able to block them away. Just 10 seconds to go here in the second round. Nice, nice! Don't get careless, okay? Don't fight his fight! There you go. That's the best. Oh, this is a wipeout. You're winning this fight. Just keep doing what you're doing, and you got this. Just there you go. That's the best. Vitaly Klitschko's back. Look at him here in the start of this round. Remember, he got tagged hard in that last round. Well, that's the reward you get when you have a good camp and you get yourself in top shape. Yeah, that's it. Mm. Uppercut. 
He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. See, this is where you can get into trouble against Vitaly Klitschko. If you allow him to land with that left hand consistently, it's going to be a tough night. Vitaly Klitschko, of course, a native of the Ukraine, got his postgraduate degree. He's known as Dr. Iron Fist. And speaking of that lofty title, he's a smart guy in the ring. I'm a doctor, too, by the way. But, you know, he has a PhD, but he is a smart guy in the ring. And, you know, that brings to the surface, to the forefront, that this is not just about physicality. You know, 75% of this business, you hear me say it all the time, is about the mental aspect, about being able to figure things out, overcome things, make adjustments. And Klitschko is still there and still successful because of that. Reaching the halfway mark of this round. Nice! Lewis is showing that he's got some defense of his own. He got away from that punch. A well-placed left hand up top. There you go. Vitaly Klitschko's blocking ability is doing well for him there. to the body, and he is down and in bad shape. One, two, three, four, five. Lewis is now getting back up off the canvas. Ten seconds to go in this third round. That's it. That's it. And round three comes to an end. No work now, right? I just need you to focus. Keep your hands up. Keep working the jab, okay? Double up the jab and just keep moving. You watch the you okay? The but I need you to use your feet, all right? Move around the... Deep breath for me. You're in control of this. Keep it up. Nice work. Start of round number four. Vitaly Klitschko's ahead on your scorecard, Teddy. Two rounds to one. Uh, a tough fight to score, but when in doubt, seems like you're going with the guy who's being more active. Yeah, but Joe, is he going to pay a price for that activity? Because sometimes there is a price to be paid. He's winning early. He's doing a lot of work to win. Does he run out of gas? That's my question right now. Lewis is coming out to fight this round after being knocked down in the previous round. Teddy, any idea? Do you think he's recouped enough here? Well, we're going to find out very quickly by looking at his legs. You're going to look downstairs just like you look downstairs in the basement of a house to see whether or not those bricks are in place or whether or not some of the mortar has kind of disappeared and the bricks are a little loose. We want to see if those legs... Fiddly Klitsch goes bang by a right hand. Hey, I know he's not in great shape, but he's doing a very good job now all of a sudden of defending himself. Well, Vitaly Klitschko did a good job weathering that storm. Well, the good news is he knows that he can take that shot. The bad news is his opponent knows he can hurt him. Well Keep timed moving. by Vitaly Klitschko. He took a step back, landed the counterpunch. Exactly what he wanted to do. Mm. 
90 seconds to go in round number four. We've seen many try to make a transition from different forms of fighting to boxing. Most Left don't do it all right, that successfully. Right. But Vitaly Klitschko was a professional kickboxer with 34 wins while he was still pursuing his boxing career. Look, Joe, anytime you get more experience in whatever form it is of getting practice at controlling your motions under duress inside a combative zone, whether it's kickboxing or boxing, that is going to play for you. That's going to serve you. Ten seconds to go in the fourth. And a nice combo by Lewis. And that does it for this round. Vitaly Klitschko's corner men have a lot of work ahead of them with that cut. You're in control. So take your time. Uh, all we need is water up there, and that's it. You don't need that, no. Throw that away. Listen now, you're letting him work. You're letting him control this fight. I don't know, I don't, you know, you, you got to him. Oh, yeah, okay. Teddy, I got to be honest with you. Based on what we saw in that last round, I didn't think we'd be broadcasting this round. I thought the fight would be over. It may be soon if his opponent can jump on him. But this could be his only chance. I don't think it can last much relax, longer. Relax. Maybe this is the moment where you expect your opponent to come after you hey, fast. Maybe your you grit up. yourself, you plant your feet, you draw a line in the sand, so to speak, and you nail him coming in. Lewis's inability to hit the target is really making him look silly right now. He's throwing plenty of punches, just none of them are landing. No, he's throwing them too wide, too far away and what's going to be worse, right now he's only getting frustrated, maybe embarrassed as you touched on, but what's going to be worse is when he starts getting counted in between them. And he engages in the clinch. A little give and take, and here comes the left hand. Lewis has got something to think about now. He just threw a punch and had one coming right back at him. His opponent scored well with the counter. Hook! Hook! Not able to land the headshot. That is a sharp uppercut by Lewis. Still plenty of time to work here in round number five. Minute and a half to go. Hover up, hover up. Nice block by Lewis. Punch, punch. Good way to protect the midsection. Block that time. It was intended to the head. <laughs> Nowhere close that punch by Lewis. Did you see that? And he goes down again. Will he get up from this?
fight's over, fight is over. Vitaly Klitschko's hand to be raised in victory. He scores the knockout here tonight. I never saw that coming, an early knockout victory. That's a stunner, Teddy. So as I look at it, maybe not as surprising as everybody else is because he came out very dry, no sweat on him at all, and he got caught cold. For Teddy Atlas, I'm Joe Tessitore. Have yourself a great evening.